Okay, I've had a few people ask me to do a video on rendering one of my HD videos because it's uh, CPU intensive. I'm using Sony Vegas Pro 9.0, which is a wonderful program. I don't think I'm using half of what it's capable of, and I'm pretty much learning as I go. And uh, I think it's fitting that I do the video on my latest cryostasis video because it was a little more in depth. I had a lot of picture in picture and a lot of wording and I had to move around some audio. And so we're looking at the screen here. If you look at this line over here, that's the beginning. And so that's what you see in YouTube right there. And all these are video layers. You know, I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine video layers and two audio layers. And so uh, Vegas Pro, you're able to make it into a final product. And if you watch the cryostasis video, you know, I have uh, picture in picture and I have several videos running at the same time. And that's how you do that with this program. And so let's go ahead and get started. I got the task manager up here. I'm at 4.5 gigahertz and I have 24 threads. So this will show everyone how long it takes for me to render a vi uh, video under those conditions. So I go over here. I'm going to render as, and I already have it set up as a uh, as 720p. And so let's go ahead and get started. Uh, let's bring up my. Okay, there we go. You can see the CPU usage there. It's running about 25, 27 percent. Let's go ahead and zoom in on that a little bit. Now we are in the beginning stages of the video. See, all it's doing right now is it is rendering you know one video feed and one audio feed now when it gets over to this point over here where I have all these layers of videos you will see the CPU usage go up uh, Vegas Pro can be very intensive so let me zoom back out uh, you can see the video right there you know this is when I was talking at the beginning and it's rendering it right now when you see the different picture and pictures pop up that's when the CPU usage uh, will go up it's estimating five more minutes to do this and I think this is what a seven minute video maybe and that's what I've been finding out it takes me if I have a ten minute video it'll take me about nine minutes to render it so it's usually one for one the rendering as opposed to how long the video is and I can't really compare that to anything I think it when I when I had just a uh, a quad core for a while uh, it was maybe taking longer, but I can't remember, so I don't know. But right now I have 24 threads, and uh, let me go ahead and move this over here where you can all see the picture-in-picture -picture kick on, and you'll see the, uh, the CPU intensity kick up as well. And we're getting, add, we're getting ready to add some layers right now. It looks to me like a couple cores aren't even being utilized right now, but wait till we get these different layers. Okay, we're still at about 28%, 29 percent, 30. Okay, now we got some, we have four layers I think right there from one, two, three, four. We just added the fifth. Six, seven, eight. There's eight layers right now of video, and you can see the CPU. It's up to about what is that? It's fluctuating between 50 and 80 percent. And a Vegas Pro is very. I mean, I watched a couple YouTube videos on how to set it up for uh, YouTube, but besides that, I've learned just about everything else on my own without going through a tutorial or anything uh, and it's it's a complicated program but with a little effort I mean you can learn to master it 
So, let's see, it's, yeah, it's fluctuating between 50 and 90 percent CPU uh, utilization. And I'm using about 4.3 gigabytes of memory. And we are currently 52% done. You know, we're about four minutes into it, and we've got about four minutes left. Now when we get towards the end, the layers are going to come back down and the CPU utilization will come back down. Okay, if you look, the top video is getting ready to end. Or no, I'm sorry. The bottom video is getting ready to end, so I'll lose some layers, so the CPU utilization should go down here in a second. Okay, there we go. We get those out. And so now we're hovering around 40 to 60. You know, no spikes up into the 80 or 90s now. Okay, and then there's the end where there was pretty much nothing going on, and so we're at 20% utilization. Of course, the ending is just me talking. So, uh, we'll just end it there. Hopefully this will give people an idea on uh, what happens when I render my videos, especially the more complicated videos. So, uh, please subscribe. If you, have, if you use Vegas Pro, and you have some times on how long it takes to render your video and what you have, please put them in the comments. Thank you.